Hey guys, what's up? It's Pro here. Um, I'm doing another editing tutorial. This one's on Sony Vegas, and it was requested by Ozexa or Dreamzexe. Um, this one it's uh, screen pumps. The screen light pumps to the beat. Uh, it's, it's quite easy. Just need. So, 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 ginger. And you want to get to the part where there's quite a few beats. So I know it can't sell like one. Fuck no, just put it there. Or you can listen to it quick. It's done. Alright, so once you've got that, you you just want to get to the part of your song that has the beats in or whatever. And get your clip, so... Let's grab this one. I already edited this clip in uh, Vegas, so that's why it's got colour correction all on it. Mm hmm Delete. Shit. A link. Delete. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to listen to your song. And you want to listen to the beat. So every time you go beat, you want to hit M on the keyboard. Make sure you're not select you're selected on the song. No, you select on anything. Uh, you want to press space and press M on the keyboard whenever you hear a, a bass drop or a beat. Uh, so once you've done that, my computer's really lagging. Um, you want to go down to where you split it. You put the M and you want to click on the little orange lines. And you'll click S on all of them. Click on them, click S, just split them. This takes really long. Alright, yeah, just do it there. Okay. And then what you want to do is you want to zoom in by scrolling up on the mouse or, you know, dragging this, making it smaller, making it bigger. And you want to click this um, video pan and crop. <coughs> Load. Okay, and then what you want to do is you've got this line, and this is your timeline in that separate split clip. So at the start, you want to. Uh, actually, it's not on this one, is it? Because the base doesn't stop. It starts on the one that you hit your first thing on, going to the right. So click event pan and crop, and you want to move it in to about in there, and then you want to go to the end of the video split with this little video and right click click restore and this is done is it's click on there see it's there right it's like quite gone in a bit 
get to there. It's going out. This is really bad. Alright, so once you've done that, you can go here and you can click it and you'll see it pump in. And that is the first beat, so this beat here and it kind of comes out. Then you want to do is you want to right click on that, click copy, select the next one, hold shift and go across to the way where it stops, so you stop splitting. Right click and click paste event attributes. What that will do is, I don't know if it was right, hold on. Let's do like this. It pumps the screen. Uh, like you can see, if you look at this little, um, whatever this is, I don't play COD no more, um, scores, whatever it is, you'll see that pumping in. The boom, so it pumps in. <coughs> I'll try and render this whole thing quick. Uh, render. Let's call it this uh render Oh god save oh, Queen God save Let's wait for that to do that quick GTA 5 in the meantime, because I'm a mouse. Man, where's my car is gone? Oh my god, this takes literally forever. Pretty good. Let's do safe house. Oh, what does it chop? Oh, it's a dog. Roof street garage, what is that? Uh -huh. It doesn't really tell me what I want to know. I want to pimp my car up, dude. Totally awesome. This game is pretty sick. Alright, uh, this is done now. Let's park up. Click open, and you see the screen pumps in and out.
Yeah, obviously you can go in as far as much as you want, but I'm just doing that for the tutorial. So, um, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. And, um, I'll see you again for the next one.